out of all Christian doctrines, I personally believe that the one which is most foundational to Christian belief is one that is often the most confused by Christians, and that is the doctrine of the Trinity. I, I firmly believe that the doctrine of the Trinity is the foundation for the nature of who God is, is the foundation for the nature of who man is, is the foundation for salvation and how we can be brought back into a relationship with God, is a foundation for marriage, it's a foundation for the church, it's a foundation for all major doctrines. And when asked, how do you define the Trinity or what is the Trinity, a Christian typically responds with something along these lines. The Trinity is like an egg. An egg has three parts and God has three parts, Father, Son, and Spirit. And while they mean well, giving that analogy, or an analogy about water in, in three different states, or an analogy about a clover and how there's three different leaves on a three-leaf clover, it really misses and actually distorts what the doctrine of the Trinity is. So the doctrine of the Trinity defined is the following. We believe in one eternal being God. That's monotheism. We believe in one eternal being God who eternally exists in three co-equal, co-eternal persons. God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. What that means is, while there is one God, there is a plurality in that one God to where there is a community in God. There's one being, but three co-equal, the Father, Son, and Spirit are all equal in power, equal in majesty, equal in glory, co-equal and co-eternal, which means all three, Father, Son, and Spirit, have always existed as unique persons co-equal, co-eternal persons, relational entities or consciousnesses, God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Spirit. They are one in one sense, they are three in another sense, and in this unfathomable God, we see who we are as people. When we look at God and we see that He is a relational God in His very nature as Father, Son, and Spirit, we look at ourselves and we see that we are relational and that our deepest desire is relationship and love. The Trinity makes sense. The Trinity explains who we are. And it's important for Christians to be able to define the Trinity. We believe in one eternal being, God, who exists eternally in three co-equal persons, God the Father, Son, and Spirit.